afternoon, and welcome back to your monthly cranial nerve examination. It's so good to see you again. You're looking fantastic. You're looking very healthy. We're going to go ahead and dive in. What I want to do first is get a listen to your lungs and your heart rate. So I'm going to pop my stethoscope in here and get a little closer look. Very good work. Everything sounds exactly as it should. I don't hear anything to be concerned about. So, nothing has been bothering you at all, no ailments of any sort. Very good. Everything looks, sounds normal. So what I'm going to start with here is our sense of smell. So I have a little collection of fragrances I'm going to have you smell. Just take a deep breath through your nose whenever you're ready, and we'll see if your nose is working properly. So start with this one. Let's 
get our second fragrance here. Just take a whiff of that one if you're ready. Does that one smell like? Yeah, exactly. Good. Okay. So four for five on the fragrances. Um, and with that one being an exception, typically patients don't get that one correct because it's sort of a niche fragrance. What's that? No, I can't tell you what it is. It's a secret. It's a secret. Okay. So what we want to do now is test your sense of taste. So I've got a couple of different fragrances here. feeling any sort of stress or anything like that, are you? Good. Okay. Good. If you start to get anxious or anything, please let me know. And I will stop with the testing. So, there's five of these as well. We'll go ahead and have you stick your tongue out. What's that one taste like? Good, yep. Very good. Good, 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 good job. Very good job, precisely correct. You 
can see there's quite a few bubbles, quite a few bubbles in this one, it's a much thicker substance, but definitely packs a punch with the flavor and tongue out. This one, again, always gotta have a curveball for you, but this one is a little bit more tricky to send, uh, detect, rather, what, what uh, flavor it is. If you get it right, though, you'll be at the top percentile of my patients. So I'm just doing out. And do you think you can get that one right? That's not it. That one is kind of tricky, so I won't knock you any points there. Good. And we got one more for you. Whenever you're ready. Okay. All right, so we're just gonna Drop there. What does that one taste like? Yep, perfect. Very good. Very, very good. That is precisely, precisely the flavor. Okay. So what we're gonna do now is test your sense of feeling in your face. So I'm gonna. Oh. Gloves on here. I don't want to get my bacteria all over your face. And we will work through this portion together. Pretty simple. And how about here? Good work. And good. Okay. Good. Good. What I'm going to do now is use this little pointer here and let me know if you feel the tip of the pointer or the tip of my finger, okay? 
Eyes closed. Good. Finger. Good pointer. Finger. your eyes now. You got that part. Uh, correct. Didn't miss any of those. What I want to do now is take a look at your scalp. Just a general overview. So you can just relax there for a minute. Very good work, that's quite consistent. anxiety, anything like that. Feeling relaxed? Good. Okay. Thank you. Alright, so I'm just gonna tomato. Football. Computer. 
Very good. Great job. You didn't miss any of those. You have really good hearing. So we'll just take a couple notes here. Basically just taking note that you didn't get any of those. Great work. Okay. Now what we're going to do is test your ability to see your eyes. I'm going to keep my gloves on here because I'm going to be feeling around your eyes and whatnot. But for this portion of the test, I'm going to have you take a look at this snow chart. This is a reduced snow chart made for this close proximity examination. So what I need you to do is read the third line down. I'll use our pointer here. So this line here, just read that left to right. Very good. And fourth line down. Good. Can you read the very bottom line? Or is that going to be too small for you? Just give it a shot. Good, good work. So, now that we can see that your eyes are working base function, we can take a look at them and check the overall physical health of the eye and your ability to follow some simple instructions right there. So, I'm just going to pull your lid down here. Look straight to the slide if you could. Just getting a really close look. Your eyes will look very nice. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is have you follow some pretty simple instructions, okay? I'm going to have my finger here. I'm going to have my light here. When I tell you to look at one or the other, just do so, okay? Look at my finger. Look at my light. Good. Look at my finger. Look at my light. Good. Look at my finger. Look at my light. Good. Look at my finger. Follow my light. Good. Follow my light. Good. Follow my light. Good. Follow my light. Good. Taking a closer look here. Okay, pulling your lid down. Follow my light. Eyes on.
So now what I need you to do, this is a very simple test, um, is just when my fingers leave your field of view, you'll just say now, okay? And if one finger gets out of your field of view before the other, just point at it, okay? All right, good. Okay, so I'm just going to get close here. Great work. Okay, my friend. Um, take a look at my chart here and make sure we got everything. Yep, okay. Well, everything looks fantastic. And I'm excited to tell you that this month's cranial nerve exam is probably the best result you've had so far. So congratulations. There's nothing else you need from me. You're free to go. Good. It's always a pleasure treating you. And I will see you again next time. All right, have a great day.